Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome. We're back. It's Kingsfield. We're at the safe spot and the fire temple. Sort of fire temple. Uh, I didn't take a sip of my of my tea yet, so I'm gonna do that. Gotta have my tea to, to get through these Kingsfield dungeons. So yeah, we have our awesome fire rod, which makes us a mage. First mage, okay, there's a fly flying around my face. Alright, I have a, a monster in my real life, a fly. Uh, oh, oh, shit. Cool. Is that earth? Looks like earth magic. Because I already got fire magic. This is indeed a grand occasion. Alexander foretold of your arrival. Receive now the power of Earth. Long live new king. I can't shout because it's late right now, so. Alright, I I am now a Earth Mage. Earth, Wind, and Fire. Still a couple elements I don't have yet. Soon you will come to know the true power of the of the gift which Alexander is bequeathed. Hail to thee, Prince of Light. I did start with light, and I did grind light earlier, so I have a lot of good light spells. But there's still one super powerful light spell that I haven't grinded for. And I might get it at some point. Alright, so we just got our, our earth magic. Is it a earth? Is it a passive earth? Yeah, I, got, I have a heal spell now. And I can grind that. Just take damage and just keep healing myself if I want to uh, which I might do I might do at some point maybe maybe not also all right so we came in from that left corridor so we're gonna go in this cave here and progress uh, this is super dark let me uh oh the music changed I just cast light and it got darker. Alright. <laughs> That's interesting. Alright, well I need a key for this with these chests. Probably like a gold key, judging by the color of the lock. I'm afraid to fall off. Am I in a uh, dungeon? This is kind of like uh, the end of Dark Souls 2. Spoiler alert. I don't know what I'm going to encounter over here. Alright. There's a big ass boulder, big ass skeleton. It's kind of like the skeleton in the second one. Is he... Okay, so he is like the other one. Shoot off the spirit of Earth is my lord. He made the clay dolls out of Earth long ago. As the dolls increased in number, they became living things without intelligence. Once alive, and with their numbers continuing to increase, they began to attack everything, even their creator, Shudam. We, the giants, tried in vain to fight against the golems, but they multiplied too quickly. We began to lose battle, and now we're nearly extinct. Lord Shudam deserted this cave as things became unimaginable or unimaginable unmanageable he took our now only surviving brother and left for an island far to the north if he could wipe out the golems I would open the door that would lead to the power of Shudam okay well I've killed some of the golems so I guess I'll come back here after I've killed more golems or all of the golems I don't know there's still a lot left in this dungeon that I haven't encountered yet. So we'll slay the golems and then we'll come back here I guess. I, I guess. <laughs> uh, so we get we have some backtracking to do. I'll try not to fall into, uh, and die. I could tell, let's see, where's the entrance? You know it might be faster to teleport and just come back through the entrance. No, it's not going to be faster, actually. We're going to go... I'm looking at my map right now, that's, that's why I'm pausing here, figuring out where. So we need to go back up through this fire area. I don't know if those 
bolder faces are gonna be back. Or not. I don't see them. Which is good. Okay. Let's let's uh not fall in the lava. I'm being careful here. So far the this is King Seal 3. So far the first two have the first three, I mean, including this one, have done pretty well to uh, keep the game fresh. It's all been unique. I mean, there wasn't any place like this in the first or second one. And that's pretty awesome, if you ask me. Okay. We're almost out of this fire area. Okay. Now we can sprint without worry. I'm not going to sprint, though. So I don't know if there's going to be enemies around the corner. Actually, I do have the shoes that help me out with that. I wonder what kind of earth magic there is. I know there's the heal spell, but there's probably a boulder like those faces were spitting. Alright, I still didn't figure out where I wanted to go. Oh, there's one of those green guys. Alright, we're going to go this way first. And... We're gonna go left. And then, oh, something like said to be nearby. A couple enemies. I forgot, I have my fireball, my fire rod. I'm gonna have to look up what raises wisdom, if it's only wisdom fruit, or if it like raises for by some other way. So I've cast hundreds of spells, and I haven't had any wisdom increases. The only wisdom increases I've had are from using uh, wisdom fruit. Staff and use fireball, it'll um, increase my strength as well. I'm gonna try that on the next enemy that isn't gonna rip me a new asshole. I'm gonna see what if that works. Okay. Okay. Um, what do we have here? I didn't look if there were those faces. Oh, there are. I see them in the back there. Let me aim this. I don't think I'm able to hit it from here. Let me use light and see if it lights, up, lights that up a little more. Ah, uh, screw you. I'm gonna have to just tank it and keep attacking. I don't know if I'm even hitting it. There we go. Definitely hit, was hitting it. Uh, I don't know if this one will hit me if I go up there, but I'm just gonna make sure. eleven because I know something was eleven. I don't think I was even hitting it. Alright. I'm out of its range. Five, 
going to go east. Oh shit, shit, shit. Oh, that was scary. Alright, that looks like one of those areas I can jump across. Like in um, the previous ones, where I have to sprint. Alright, let's see. Yeah. Okay. So we're now... Alright, there's a save ahead of me. Oh, shit. I wasn't expecting that, but... Fish in a barrel now. Lightning bolt. Do I have it equipped? Let's see if it's all hit it. I don't know if I hit them. I don't want to waste my mana though. Well, I got. Well, I've got to heal anyway. On. I don't need to use that right now. I used wind cutters, so uh, my spell cooldown will go back to, to being fast because I can't use a fireball without full mana. So I'll take this opportunity to drink some tea. These take. Hits each. I'm definitely glad I went this way first. All right. We're not going in there. I just wanted to kill those, so I didn't have to worry about them later. I have to go in there. That wasn't optional. Alright, is there another one in here? Let me hear another one. Good, I only took a couple damage. What's that thing? Not that, the thing in front. It's just a rock. Yeah. I'm actually going to equip Flash. I'm going to use this on the next goal because I'm going to use a gold f potion soon. Alright, we're going left first. That's such an awesome spell. Spell cooldown because of flash takes forever. I did hit it a couple times, so this should, this should uh, wound him. Or it should already be wounded. Or I might have only hit the other one. Nah, I was wounded. Okay, I'm just killing those guys. And we'll continue. Go down this way now. All right. Ain't no 
nobody afraid of you now that I have my unlimited fireball. Unlimited powerful fireball. Okay. It's over here. I'll be using fireball on you. This weapon is so cheap. And we're jumping in. Alright, so there's that, which looks really freaking scary to jump across. Or that, which also looks pretty scary to jump across. Oh, but there's a switch over there and a chest. Alright, so we're and a goal map to kill, so we're gonna go that way. This actually looks a lot easier to get across than the one to the right anyway. Also, it's not earth crystal. That is a treasure chest. That's gold for me. That's all those crystals are to me is gold. Cause I don't really mind grinding off camera. Uh, which way do I want to go? Let's go straight. Okay, music's changing. Alright, is it one of those faces? No. Oh shit. Maybe it'll get closer and I can like... Hit it with my fireball. Staff too awesome. Those fireballs should really cost like one mana or something. Like even even just one mana would balance this weapon out. cost 11 fireballs, so this is going to be who knows how many. I'm so glad I sold my map for this staff. Right. Who's your mama? Okay, we're not jumping down there because I don't know what's there. And my map says this horseshoe's around, so we're just gonna go this way. Oh, maybe it doesn't horseshoe around. It's in this. Eh. Or right. Okay, so it doesn't horseshoe around. I have to jump in. So, the horse is around the other way. Maybe. Okay, so that's that golem. And nothing else. It's just a way for me to get the hell out of there if I when I jump in. Okay. 
And we're not going to go that way. We're going to cross over here. Watch I like fall off. Hey, you're back. That actually kind of scared me. I know you wouldn't have noticed by my calm demeanor, but... It's getting late and I'm kind of tired. Speaking of, I... Oh. Take a quick sip of tea whilst I, I get this skeleton aggroed on me. All right, now we're gonna we're gonna head back to the area we came from, and all right, how do we get back? Uh, I think we have to go back around. Did I drop in here? Yeah, I dropped in from that. So we'll have to go around through here. Jump down here. Let me look around. This is where those golems were. Giant skeleton. This should be a, a save thing here, so we're going to save real quick. And I think this is a good place to end the episode. So we'll end the episode here, and we'll continue exploring the rest of this dungeon uh, next time. So thanks, guys, for watching. We'll see you next time.